a field of nine for the 13th race late closer three and four year old Phillies and mayors sponsored by Clark distributing they're the distributors of Coors and the Miller products in the Lexington area they're heading toward the start for the 13th race And they're off. OG Starlet from the outside committed to try for the lead. MD Jewel from in between horses has come away well. Nuclear Finale also up close for the rail position. No kiss and tell will slide in fourth in front of Pearl Burley. Squash you like a bug has come out racing in six. Jade Solari is in behind her seventh. Advantis is on her eight early from eighth. And at the back of the pack is What About Ride, who trails in ninth. And their straight alignment as they head toward the quarter. OG Starlet starts to back into him. The quarter in 27 and 3. Miller's on the move with Nuclear Finale up on the outside. Nuclear Finale now second, and she's gunning hard to challenge for and take command. Racing in third on the inside is MD Jewel. That is about three lengths back to no kiss and tell. Pearl Burley is two lengths behind her in fifth. Squash you like a bug, riding the pile on sixth. Advantis trying to get some cover flow going from seventh. Jate Solari is eighth on the inside, and what a boat ride. A bit sluggish trails the field as they hit the half in 55 and 3. So nuclear finale assume command with that backside brush, and she's a length in front of OG Starlet. Right there in third is MD Jewels followed all the way. No kiss and tell now comes first over, and Pearl Burley tracks that move. She's second over on the outside, just five lengths from the lead. Advantis finds herself third over. Shuffled back is squash you like a bug. Jate Solari fourth over in eighth position. And what a boat ride is gapped out last as they pace past the three-quarter marker in 125 and 1. And it's Nuclear Finale as they come to the top of the stretch. And Nuclear Finale still pacing strongly with a two-length lead. OG Starlin waiting as long as possible in behind her. And now Fred Finn wheels her to the outside. And it's Nuclear Finale digging in with a two-and-a-half length margin. OG Starlin is second. No kiss and tell racing in third. Nuclear Finale is going to give Dave Miller his fourth win on the card nuclear finale despite a busted wheel disc in 153 and two finishing second was og starlet no kiss until third returning to the winner circle number one nuclear finale the newest acquisition of the fs star stables from glenwood new jersey dave sampatelli trains and what a day for dave miller here at lexington that's his fourth winner on the card nuclear finale is a nuclear siren, Ohio bred three year old of the Niatros mare Carnegie Hill. She was bred by Bruce Trogdon's Emerald Highlands Farm in Ohio. In the winner's circle to make the trophy presentation, the Red Mile welcomes Mike Nickerson, who's the district vice president for Clark Distributing, the distributors of Coors and Miller products here in the Bluegrass Lexington area. So it is official, and it's nuclear finale for the FS Star Stables. Dave Sabatelli and Dave Miller in 153 and two fifths.